Our next guest says she just stumbled into acting. In fact, she just stumbled up here moments ago. We're going to find out why. Most would-be actresses wish they could uh, stumble so well. You should have seen it. She's appeared in The Laughing Policeman with Walter Matthau, recently in Blade Runner with Harrison Ford, and soon she's going to be seen in the new NBC summer replacement series called Buffalo Bill. Here is Joanna Cassidy. How come? What happened? You got here late. I was late. What happened? I don't like to say about it. <laughs> not gonna tell I can't us, tell you what happened. No. <laughs> but you just made it. Yeah. Made it in the nick of time. So tell us about this new show. What would you like to know about it? Well, you know, who's in, what is the, what's well, it about? Well, okay, it's, it's sort of a... How long is it going to be on? Uh, well, uh, we hope for a long time, but besides that, it's sort of a, uh, I don't know, bird's eye view of what it's like to make a TV show, an on-the-air show. And uh, I play the director, Dabney Coleman plays the talk show host. And we sort of, you know, and then the, all the other characters. So this is like a spoof on TV talk shows. Well, it's not really a spoof. No. It, it's very real. It is? Yes, it is. <laughs> we, have a, we have a clip from it. We'll It looks pretty good. Number, yeah. yeah. Well, that's, you know, mostly now they're just doing three or six. Yeah, that's true. That, that's all they're buying now. So we'll be on for the whole summer and hopefully into the fall if it catches on. Mm -hmm. What's Dabney Coleman like to work with? The best. Absolutely he's, the he's best. Good. He's uh, uh, he's just a very giving actor. I mean, he's one of the, the, the special people of the world. I mean, he has enough, has to have enough energy for everybody. He's got a lot of words to say. And uh, it just cooked. Everybody just really cooked. I mean, do? it was like a family that was established after the second show, which is kind of rare. What does the show take place in Buffalo? Well, yes, mm -hmm. Buffalo Bill, so, and right. he must be Bill. Yes, he must yeah. be Bill. <laughs> now, we said you stumbled into acting. Is that true? Really? Uh, well, it, well, it was not my first choice. Um, I wanted to actually be a car salesman, but <laughs> no, no, I'm just, just kidding. Uh, I was a scientist, and I also was interested in art. A scientist? Mm -hmm. What type of scientist? Anything. I, I was going to be an entomologist, actually. And then you or a lepidopterist. And then all of a sudden, there you are with Walter Matha. That's right. In a movie. That was your first role? Mm-hmm. That quick? That quick. How did it happen? I don't know. I audition, and there you were? I talked to my psychic, and she just, you know... I, I, I just did. Actually, I'll tell you the truth. I, I ran into a lady by the name of Joyce Selznick, who has now passed on, but I, I can say that she really was uh, a mentor in my career. She was a wonderful woman, and it really helped me along. Was she an agent? She was a, a personal manager, and she also cast. Uh, cast. did a lot of casting. See, isn't that uh, Doug here struggled for years and years and years, and he carried up six floors on a... Crane. I know it's isn't amazing. <laughs> well, you did it with a couple movies, and then is this your first television show? No, I had series? the 240 Robert series with Mark Harmon and John Perry, uh, where I played a helicopter pilot. All these professional roles. Geez. Well, no, there's some adventure for you. Sure. Yeah. yeah, it's a good series, actually. Yeah, thank you. Well, we're going to uh, look forward to uh, me, especially to, to Buffalo Bill, because right. all talk show hosts, you know, they're not that dumb. They, usually, they know, <laughs> they know what's going on. And I think we're going to a commercial. <clears throat> I think. There's I said commercial. Commercial. No. We'll be right back with uh, Robert. <laughs> Robert Woods.